Hi everyone, it's Nisha. So today I'm so excited. I have a new wig for you. Uh, this one that I am wearing right now is John Renault Julian Light. And there is a reason why I'm wearing this wig. But the wig that I have for you to review, it's brand new from Raquel Welch and it's called Boudoir Glam in Shaded Ice Sweet Cream. So Raquel Welch, uh, they came out with five new wigs, which he, it was very quiet about it. But I saw Taz reviewing this wig and I thought I have to have it. So I bought it with my own money. And the reason I really wanted it, it made me feel very nostalgic because this is inverted stag bob, very similar hairstyle to what I had years ago. Anyway, this is quite a new color. Although I have this wig from Raquel Welch, which is called Current Affairs, that I got ages ago in the same color. And I think they were just trying this color out because the, those new five wigs come in this new color. And I hope they will do all day wigs in that color. But the new thing about it is they cap. So there is a brand new cap, it's called Lux Light Cap. It's fully hand tied. It has extended lace front from ear to ear. And you can see it has that left hand side monofilament, but because it's all hand tied, you can still part it any way you like and you will get the same. I don't really know why why there is a monofilament when you have full hand tight cap. I don't know. But the transition, normally if you have wefted cap, the transition from the monofilament to the wefts is quite, it sticks out a bit, is velvety, whereas this is completely flat, really smooth, you can't even feel it. You also get these silicone ear tabs, which are quite big. You will get, get great um, coverage and extended nape. These will really help your wig to almost stick to your skin. But if you don't like it, I was watching Frank, one of the designers from Raquel Welch, and he said that the silicone patches are hand stitched. So if you don't like that, you want just the velvet ones, you can unpick it and take them off but i think these are very helpful so it should feel really really comfortable and this cup probably is amazing so the reason i am wearing john renault's julian light in palm springs blonde is because this new color the shaded ice sweet cream is your equivalent to Palm Springs Blonde. So you know my very favorite color from Raquel Welch is Shaded Biscuit, but I think now this is my second favorite. So if you found Shaded Biscuit still a bit too warm, although I don't think it's warm, it's pretty neutral and very bright, but this is definitely cool blonde. It is not gray, it is not ashy, it's a very, very bright, creamy blonde with some platinum, I would say. Uh, but as you can see, it's almost identical to the Palm Springs Blonde. Obviously, this will look a bit different because you have curls here and this is straight. But it is identical. So if you love the Palm Springs Blonde and you always wanted Raquel Welch color blonde, then go for this new color. Okay, let me put her on. Wow. I love it. This is straight from the box. You don't have to do anything to it. Let's talk about the cup. The cup fits like a dream. This is petite average. My measurement is 21 and a quarter inches. So I think if you are average, it will still fit you. The cap is quite stretchy, but if you are large, that probably won't fit you. I had to slightly tighten it 
it feels so comfortable I don't even feel it on my head I would say that this cup feels nicer than the John Renault light so this is like an equivalent I suppose to the John Renault light collection the hand tight cup very light um, nicely fitted the John Renault has silicone tabs as well but they are a bit smaller you get brilliant coverage on here now this is also true to life fiber so you can heat style it and I probably will straighten this I don't like it when the hair just cups my face like this so I will probably um, straighten it so you can use heat up to 350 Fahrenheit on it the color is gorgeous and I am so surprised because with the current events the first one I've shown you in that color it had so much hair it felt really flat falling forward it was too much hair at the front this one feels so much lighter it's not flat which really really surprises me because with normal wefted cups you usually get a bit of permatease that's what gives you the body but this is hand tight cup there is no permatease but you still get a lot of body and I think this is due to the haircut uh, let me pull up the vital statistics so the front is eight and a half inches the crown is six and a half inches sides for four and a half inches and nape two inches so can you see you have much shorter shorter layers here on the top and that's what gives you body let me show her to you from all the sides this is so gorgeous so here we go here is the front left side the back look how lovely this fits on an ape great coverage really tight to your neck and here is the right side what a gorgeous wig I absolutely love it and look at it this is straight out the box it doesn't fall forward it has that curve here so it's ready it's parted on a left but like I said because of this cap you won't see any weft you can part it on any side you want you can part it in the middle but I quite like it as it is on a on a left this is absolutely gorgeous so you can puff it up if you want more volume or you can smooth it right down if you want it flatter <laughs> you know me this is definitely not me what is it the higher the hair the closer to heaven so I obviously would have it puffed up but I definitely want to straighten these so they are more straight instead of coming round my face I just I feel like I'm wearing a hunky you know on my head so but I think if you've got really nice pointy chin chiseled chin that will look lovely but for my face shape I need it straighter have a look at the picture of me years ago with very similar haircut the only difference uh, was that I used to have a fringe but I had inverted bob that stacked bob for years and I've been actually recently thinking to cut my hair into that but you know what this this haircut has to always be styled otherwise you look a mess especially with fa fine hair like mine I don't have the problem with the bag because especially when it's so layered I get lots of volume in my own hair but you know how thin 
my sides up and you with this haircut you don't get much of the length just here and this is my thinner part of my hair so and also you can't really put it up you can sort of just put up the front but you can't put your hair up with a haircut like this that's why I haven't had it done again but now I've got this wig this is just beautiful so elegant so chic and with when it comes to styling I wouldn't do much to it the only thing I would do is probably tuck in one side or you know you could put nice clip here that's the only thing I would do I mean you can have it right of your face if you want but I'm not liking it like this I just love it like that and this is just so so chic now let's try it with some sunglasses my huge ones from Gucci gorgeous the sunglasses fit perfectly these are Chloe none of these sunglasses are new so I don't know if they are still available and let's try these ones they're really a bit more squarish I normally wear round yeah that looks good too this cap fits so beautifully I very often wear these these wig grips which are velvety and they have that lace insert which you put on the side with the pertinis this can help if your wig is a bit too loose because this adds a bit of bulk and stops your wig from slipping as long as you apply it you have to fill it so if you feel resistant that way that's the way you put it on so when you go like this with your wig it can't move anywhere but with this cap I don't feel I even need this it fits so well it feels so secure and to be honest I probably could have tightened it even more this is my new favorite wig this is just so gorgeous right let me just compare this color for you to the shaded biscuit so I have here Raquel Welch wavy day in shaded biscuit can you see whenever I wear shaded biscuit it looks very bright because it has much brighter pieces here at the front can you see but it has a mixture of sort of honey highlights in it as well so when I put them next to each other you can definitely see the difference that this is much warmer although I don't consider this blonde to be warm it's very neutral bright and neutral but comparing to this one it looks much warmer so if you are after that cool bright blonde then the shaded ice, ice sweet cream is for you I think this color comes also without roots so if you don't like the rooted look you can go just for ice sweet cream so how you know it is the SS so whenever you have the SS on Raquel Welch color number or name that means it's shaded which means which means that it has a root so if this one was without the root it wouldn't have the SS okay my lovely so this was Boudoir Glam by Raquel Welch in shaded ice sweet cream let me know what you think of this one but if you wear wigs and you like that sort of 
elegant, chic, but quite fun and sexy, I think. Look, don't think twice. This is just gorgeous. You can buy this wig on any wig website, I suppose, but I have a discount code for Mima wigs, so I will leave it down in the description box. If you want to get a bit of a discount, then you are welcome to use it. But that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous. Bye.